Hello explorers, welcome back to Da Nang in Vietnam and for the first time in about 10 days we have a dry day and I am going to take complete advantage of that and take you on and explore and we've got a jumbo jet just flying at the side of us Wow, that's slow. Anyway, let's go and explore. And where we are exploring today is called Park Lake. You've got local people fishing. I don't know if you can see it in the distance there, but there's an amusement park. We'll get a closer look up at it towards the end of the walk. And today is a perfect day for exploring because there's a nice gentle breeze. This is beautiful, really tranquil other than the plane noises, there must be an airport nearby. And yes, obviously the park runs all the way around this huge lake here in the city. And you can hear the noise of all of the bikes behind me and the planes. But that breeze is amazing. The one thing that I would say to you if you come to this park is be very careful when you are walking around. There's loads of moss on the paths and it's slippy. So this is marked on Google Maps as 29 slash free park. I don't know if that's its name or what, but I think it's also called City Lake Park. What I wanted to do today is just come for a walk and give you a bit of a commentary on the place that I'm exploring. the locals sat against the lake fishing just over the lake there you might be able to hear all the madness of the traffic we're gonna head into some street life soon just want to finish walking around this lake give you an idea of the architecture around here I have no excuse at all about not having a gym in Vietnam loads of outdoor equipment as you walk around the park The weather is looking out for me, thank you, because we're a week away from Christmas and this is the weather that I want. Great place to dry all of your clothes in the sunshine. This is sad to see though, these reindeers in this pen. Hello mate, how are you doing? You're on YouTube. Admittedly, I am not a lover of zoos. It should be out in the natural habitat. And now in the amusement park and these look like the back from the 1980s I'm not too sure how safe it is <laughs> Not too sure what this ride is neither I understand it opens at the weekend after 3 p.m. Also a merry-go-round that was a really enjoyable walk around the lake and park. I've been walking for about an hour and a half now. It's been good to get away from the hustle and bustle of Da Nang. Right now though, we're gonna go and see some street life. We are also going to find some local food to eat because my stomach is grumbling. I hope you are enjoying the video so far. So I grabbed a Grab Taxi, which cost me about a pound. And I'm now back in the old town. Thought we'd go for a wander around and see some street life and get some food. I think this is a Buddhist temple, but I could be wrong. So yes, today's vlog is a little bit random. It's me walking around Da Nang, just giving some commentary. I know people like these videos, some people don't. The good thing about doing this type of content for me is that it's really easy. But also you get to see a little bit of the places that I'm exploring. Okay, I have to cross this road. <laughs> oh dear me. To cross you just walk across the road as I've said before There's just no rules here at all with regards to turning left or right or anything at all And yes, this is typical seating here in Vietnam as you can see like preschool chairs and tables really low on the floor I mentioned this on Instagram the other day but the power cables in communication I guess telephone cables if they have them okay I've been to the ATM it's now time for some food so I just found somewhere to eat I've ordered my noodles so this is lunch got fried noodles with a ton of vegetables and a nice cold can of beer just look at that looks absolutely delicious just to give you an idea of how much that lunch cost me it was two pound about two dollars fifty cents for a big plate of noodles and a beer 
I'm just stood in the shed right now with this breeze, it's so nice. Now I shouldn't talk too soon, but if it is like this for the remainder of my stay here in Danan, which is about 12 days, then I am going to be very happy. So I've just found this little park, which is really nice, just alongside the riverfront. I couldn't understand why the guy was washing his cockerel, and what I've just seen wasn't nice. I didn't want to get it on video, but basically it's cockerel fighting. I suppose there's not a great deal you can say about that really, it's just a cultural thing. Well, I wasn't expecting to see that today. Just wandering around in a public place, just so natural fighting your cockerels. Who knows if I will get the Christmas that I dream of walking on the white sandy beach with a cocktail and chilling out in the sea. We shall see. I am back in my apartment. I've been cooling off for the last hour. I've really enjoyed my walk around Danang today and I hope you have enjoyed this random vlog. If you would like me to do a video exploring my local neighbourhood, then please do let me know down in the comments. If you've enjoyed this video, let me know if you've got any questions or comments. Leave them down below. You know I enjoy your comments. Until my next video, which will be very soon, please take care and travel safe. See you soon.